the MORE Caliph, the surf moved nearly 100 miles inland Saturday too. The surf ranch for the World Surf League's Founders Cup. The highly anticipated competition debuts Kelly Slater's perfect wave and has the potential to impact the future of surfing, a notion. Surfers welcome, I don't know how we could have found this place, said Matt Wilkinson, a surfer for Team Australia. It's a pretty weird spot to put it but I think it makes it kind of amplifies what it is, more than 5,000 people will pack WSL Surf Ranch this weekend to watch 25 of the world's top surfers compete for the first time on a man-made wave. Honestly, I'm a lot more nervous because everyone's watching that one wave, said Joel Parkinson, the 2012 world champion. Usually in the ocean it happens so quickly, whereas here you have a minute or two to start. Your heartbeat, it's really hard to stay calm, at the push of a button, the 700-yard waves give surfers the ability to surf. In a controlled environment, another first for the WSL, we call it the Stoke Machine, said Kelly Slater, an 11-time world champion. Everyone just has a huge grin on the face and the most common reply is, it's just like the ocean, I thought it would be different or whatever and... It's just like a real wave, our goal was to make a swell that was like a strong swell in the ocean, the feeling is the same, said Parkinson. You're so ecstatic after a wave, you're smiling from ear to ear and that's what they created, World Surf League, Kelly Slater Reed, full story more sports.